Hey guys, I wanted to do something a little different this time around. I want to do a pre-review prediction on the movie The Meg. Meaning, I'm going to predict my future rating of The Meg when I go see it this Saturday. Um, based off of trailers, marketing, and previous shark movies. Now, I know you're probably saying that you can't really do that based one movie off of other movies. I disagree with shark movies because they all typically follow a trend. I think we can all agree with that. But no matter what, I love shark movies. I always try to go see them, to be honest. And you know what? I'll give a rating. I'll list a few shark movies and give ratings. And at the end of this video, I will predict what I'm going to give the Meg. The first shark movie up is a classic. It's Jaws. I give Jaws 9 out of 10. I mean, I think the movie speaks for itself. Good shark movie. Um, the next one is The Shallows. Now, I wanted to love this movie. I give it a 4.5 out of 10. I just, it had potential. It just didn't work for me. Um, the next one, 47 meters down. This one was actually okay. It the some of the suspense was decent. I give it to him. Uh, I'll give it a five out of ten. Forty-seven meters down. I saw it twice. I enjoyed it a little bit. It's probably a guilty pleasure of mine, um, but it could have been better. The next one is Deep Blue Sea. Um, I love this movie. I'm probably one of the few rare people who do. But I love Deep Blue Sea. I I give it an eight out of ten. From this, I know the CGI isn't that great. The movie came out in '99, so for its time, it was pretty good. You know, Samuel Jackson's death that sticks with you. The I remember one scene where the guy gets lifted on a hel helicopter because he you know got his arm bitten off. Spoiler alert: not really. It's been out since 99, like I said. So anyway, the guy gets his arm bitten off. He gets taken away in the helicopter. And then next thing you know, he's in a shark's mouth and a shark throws him against the window. That's, I got to give it to you. I, I, that's another scene that I liked. Like Deep Blue Sea is probably my number one shark movie and Jaws is number two. I know you're going to hate me. Sorry. Um, and for those of you saying that, hey, sharks are being put in a bad light I, it's a movie I don't think we want a cuddly shark a friendly shark mind you on the screen speaking of friendly sharks though my favorite part of Finding Nemo is Bruce I'm sorry I love sharks I'm a sucker for shark movies if the movie has sharks in it I, I'm i sorry my favorite part of Finding Nemo which is a 10, by the, 10 out of 10 by the way is Bruce. I love Bruce. I remember sitting in the theater as a kid watching Finding Nemo and the scene where they turn around and Bruce is smiling in their face is a jaw dropping moment. Seeing that on the big screen, one of my favorite moments in the movie. Just saying. Now, based off of the Mac trailers and the fact that, which I love, by the way, I love the trailers that they've done and the fact that I love shark movies, I'm going to estimate that or predict that i'm going to give the mag nine out of ten yeah i'm not going to say mad reels because this is not an official review this is the pre-review so yeah i'll say for now i think i'm going to give the mag nine out of ten um and by the way i love the cast i love jason state the movies um the fact that rain wilson is in it from the office i love the office so i'm excited to see him in it and I'm also excited to see Paige Kennedy. I've been following him since Vine, so I can't wait to see what he brings to the movie. So comment what you think you're going to rate the movie before you see it. And or comment what you think I'm going to rate the movie after I see it on Saturday. Um, once again, thank you for watching this movie. Place, put your bets in. Like, comment, subscribe. And remember to keep it mad real out there.